I got to catch a film that I know you saw at Sundance earlier this year. It is a documentary that was one of the winners out of Sundance, The Eternal Memory, a really beautiful film uh, that comes from director Maite Alberti uh, that takes a look at this elder, elder Chilean couple navigating life after one of them is diagnosed with Alzheimer's. And, you know, it, it's a just really intimate look into what it's like to age as a couple, what it's like to watch a loved one sort of slowly lose the life that illuminated them, and and what it's like dealing with that sort of end-of-life type of care. It, it's really beautiful and really personal, but I think it also transcends all of that to go to another level through the way that uh, Maite Alberti is able to incorporate archival footage, able to incorporate the story of what the country of Chile was going through at the time, making the personal political in a really, really profound way. Uh, you know, the the couple that are being profiled, Augusto Gon, uh, Gongora is a former journalist and Paulina Rutia is a uh, actress. So both of them have plenty of video archives to pull from, which also lets them tell a fuller story. Um, but you know, they use that particularly in the end in this way that is so transcendent transcendent and beautiful that I, I would find it hard to imagine walking away from this documentary being anything but completely moved. So uh, The Eternal Memory, I think that it is going to be a major contender in the year-end documentary races. I would not be surprised to see it get shortlisted either for the Best Documentary Oscar or maybe even a foreign film Oscar uh, coming from Chile. Really, really enjoyed this, or maybe enjoyed the wrong one, really, really appreciated this one. Uh, and if it's playing near you, I'd highly recommend checking it out. Uh, the director previously did The Mole Agent, which did pretty yeah. well at Great the Oscars. Movie. Um and I remember when you went to go see it, I told you, I was like, uh, Chile? Just Chile, shortlisted yeah. it. But they always go with the boy, Pablo, who has his own movie coming out. Mm -hmm. But he is producer on this. So it's like this he really is. interesting, it's going to come down to the wire. You know, if only they could do multiples, but, you know, they can't because that's not, the, I guess, the way the world works. Yeah. Um, but, yeah. What's his movie that's coming up? I know it's going to be at TIFF. Oh, shoot. I forget the name of it. But oh. isn't it like a... El Conde. Yeah, there we go. So we'll see. It's going to be between the one you just mentioned. This one looks beautiful too, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, we'll see. We'll see which way they take it.